हाय फ्रेंड्स मॉर्निंग आई एम डॉक्टर आशुतोष आई एम ए फीटल मेडिसिन कंसल्टेंट राइट तो फीटल वेलबींग और फीटल डॉपलर्स आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट राइट बट हाउ द सिचुएशन एंड हाउ द थिंग्स दे कैन चेंज विद इन वीक्स टाइम ये मैं आपको आज बता देता हूँ सो देर इज एन एंटिटी कॉल्ड इज अ ब्रेन स्पेयरिंग राइट सो वेन एवर दी वेन एवर दी दी अम्बलिकल आर्ट रेजिस्टेंस इज हायर and then subsequently there is a some event called as a brain sparing right so in a brain sparing what happens is this that the baby uh, identifies that there is some risk involved and therefore uh, uh, diverts the blood from a non essential to an essential organs so meaning thereby that the central circulation is being maintained at the expense of a peripheral circulation सेंट्रल सर्कुलेशन मेंटेन होने का मतलब होता है कि ब्रेन में लीवर हार्ट एंड एड्रेनल ग्लैंड्स को ब्लड सप्लाई बढ़ जाती है या मेंटेन करने की कोशिश करता है बेबी एट द एक्सपेंस ऑफ दिस प्लेंगनिक मिजेंट्रिक एज वेल एज रीनल ब्लड फ्लो राइट तो ये बहुत अच्छा केस है जिससे मैं आपको ये समझा देता हूँ कि ये ब्रेन स्पेरिंग पैथोलॉजिकल कैसे होता है और हम इसको किस तरह से इंटरप्रेट करते हैं और कैसे हम बेबी को बाहर निकालते हैं so this was a one case in which the uh, the the lady and the mother herself is a doctor right she came to us at something around 32 weeks then we identified ki umbilical artery ki resistance how on a higher side hai and uh, <coughs> all all the things were they were matching and uh, the, the the baby's growth was was, uh, was absolutely fine the efi was also fine so we told her that probably we need to keep the baby under surveillance and uh, to us to see that there is no deterioration for the umbilical artery within a week's time what has happened is this that the umbilical artery resistance both ri and pi from 50th centile they have gone to approximately 95th centile the afi has drastically reduced from a normal to 5th centile right and the weight gain in, in the interim period was only for something around 70 grams or so right so this matches to a classical brain sparing right so the umbilical artery both ri and pi they are above the 50th centile but then they less than 95th centile and uh, the afi is well within the normal range less than 50th centile for the gestational age both uterine arteries ri and pi are well within the normal range right if we see for the fetal weight uh, we identify that it is uh, 2160 grams to 160 grams right within a within a span of an weeks time what has happened is this, the uterine arteries have gone up to both ri and pi they have gone to 95th centile this is the this is the umbilical artery pi has gone to 95th centile the afi has gone to 50th centile for the gestational age the uh, the the weight gain is hardly 60 grams right so this is brain sparing so within a weeks time umbilical artery deteriorated the afi got down the central circulation maintained at the expense of the renal artery blood flow and therefore the afi reduced we told her that uh, we are in for a very difficult situation we should plan for a baby and we matlab we can we can we can plan the delivery of the baby at something on 34 weeks for which she agreed <coughs> but uh, astonishingly in the evening when she got admitted within 12 hours there was a ctg abnormality late decelerations we took the baby out so identifying and putting uh, uh, at a close surveillance as far as the well being of the baby is concerned and all these things um, uh, could salvage uh, um, a difficult situation right thank you very much for your patient listening